Coming back with another Drip Network video. Today we're going to be talking about why Drip, about the partners. Drip's 30 cents. Before we get into it, could you please Mike Tyson the like and subscribe button? So we'll just look real quick. You can see Drip is minted about 18, let's see, 230,000 in the last 24 hours. Uh, there's 4,000 in the, the vault when this bot was active. Almost 19 million loose Drip, about 13.3 million in people's wallets. So inflation is still chugging along. Uh, I know a lot of people are anticipating Triple D, but today I just want to talk about, it looks like uh, according to this Nomadic for Life, there's 320 million total active deposits in Drip. So you can go on to dripnetwork.ca and check out how many uh, Drip people are hydrating and claiming. So you can see it's about 2.3 million almost uh, between hydrations and claims. So any uptick in price, you're gonna see more claims, fewer hydrates. So let's just take a look. So for me, like here, I don't know why people do this, try to misrepresent and kind of make it sound bigger than it is. So like you say, our partner's BSC scan. I mean, this is just some crummy token I made back in the day. Um, just when I found out how you can make your own uh, token on BSC scan. So one, there's lots of, you know, Binance Smart Chain, since it's easy to implement projects on it, there's been a lot of scam projects on the Binance Smart Chain. And all those tokens were on BSC scan. Uh, and so it's not really a partner. I mean, basically anyone that makes a token, uh, once that information's on the blockchain, now maybe if you log in and do something different, but even scam coins have that. So I don't really see that as a partner. Bloomberg, Yahoo Finance, they basically just had those drip articles. The marketing company sent out, it's the same articles. It's the only thing I've seen is same articles on Yahoo Finance and Bloomberg. I've never seen any independent um, journalism. So it seems like a lot of this stuff is a medium. Anyone can start a medium. So I don't know if they're really partners. I mean, anyone can start a medium page. So I just never really understood why people like to kind of misrepresent this stuff to make them sound bigger than they are. Again, I mean, I guess it's kind of marketing strategy. Someone comes here and goes, wow, look at all these partners. And I know a lot of other people have seen it. To me, it... It makes the projects look bad and I don't like it. Maybe it doesn't bother you. Maybe you like it. But like BSC Scan is not really a partner. You paid to have articles on Yahoo Finance Bloomberg. I guess in a sense you can say it's a partner, but not really. I mean, no one there probably even knows what uh, Drip is. Medium's not really a partnership. And I'm not even going into some of these other ones. It's just, uh, you know, Dex Tools, pretty much probably anyone that has. Uh, a coin on Binance Smart Chain shows up on Dex Tools, so that is just my take. What do you let let me know what you think about these kind of misrepresented partners? And does it bother you? Do you care? Are you happy? And so that's my two cents. And you can see, yeah, it drips at thirty cents. A lot of people anticipating triple D. You can see that there's over three hundred twenty million active deposits. I think that excludes. Anyone that reached a hundred thousand max payout, you know, basically those drip are just you know gone forever now. So yep, let me know what you think. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.